It's a real pleasure to talk to you. Thank you so much. And what trends are driving the adoption of additive manufacturing in the industrial sector today? Well, it's a pleasure to meet you too, and thanks for having me. Um, there are a number of trends that are affecting the adoption of additive manufacturing. I think companies are looking to be able to, to be more sustainable. I think that companies are looking to be able to develop and produce products a lot faster. And I think that it's really becoming more important for companies to be able to produce parts where they're needed instead of depending on very long and complicated supply chains where when things might get disrupted, it gets very difficult to get the parts and products that you need. Uh-huh. And how is Siemens helping companies integrate additive manufacturing into their questions in an efficient and scalable way? Siemens is doing a lot to help companies um, to, to become more effective. We're, we're basically enabling companies to become digital enterprises, mm -hmm. to, to adopt digital technology that can combine the the virtual the, and the real worlds together so that you gain greater insights into what the company is doing. Um, we're helping companies to, to engineer products and the manufacturing processes as well as execute those processes. So well, with digitalization and our um, accelerator portfolio, we're enabling companies to become more digital and, and become more smarter, faster, um, um, more productive. Oh, amazing. And how are technologies search as digital twins, automation and simulation transforming the additive manufacturing process? So with um, digitalization, we help companies to develop digital twins of the product, uh -huh. process of, of the manufacturing execution. And when companies create digital twins, they gain greater insight into how the product works, how the manufacturing process works. And when companies leverage this sort of technology, um, they're able to avoid making mistakes mm -hmm. because they can do it in the digital world before they get to the physical world. And um, in addition to the digital twins, we're super powering the twins with artificial intelligence. Yeah. And the AI is playing a bigger role in engineering and manufacturing today due to what Siemens is doing. In what ways is the integration of software, hardware, and data redefining part designing and production? I, I think the, the integration of, of data with part design and, and manufacturing, engineering, and production is, is changing dramatically now because of the introduction of artificial intelligence. Um, AI is making it much easier for engineers to be more productive. Yes. Um, because AI can offer suggestions to engineers about how to use software, how to make engineering decisions, and AI can also help act as a data scientist to look at data that was collected from production about what happened and give you insights into it um, and save you a ton of time. So um, the integration of all of these technologies with artificial intelligence is really changing the way that people are engineering and manufacturing products. Yes, absolutely. And how does additive manufacturing contribute to more sustainable and efficient operations. So additive manufacturing is a really cool technology because it's helping companies to um, basically um, to produce the, just the right amount of material that they need in order to manufacture parts. So instead of traditional ways of manufacturing with CNC machining where you start with a large block of material and then you machine away everything that you don't need and end up with a part, it usually is a lot of waste. With additive manufacturing, we can just print exactly what we need and then machine it to finish it where we can save a ton of material. So additive manufacturing is quite a game changer when it comes to making parts and products. Oh yes, thank you. Thank you very much. And here on CES 2026, directly from Las Vegas on Siemens Booth. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye, -bye.